taking the leap of faith. I know it can be scary at times when you're trying to figure out a direction in your life, right? You're trying to figure out what the next steps are, what's the most efficient pathway, whatever the case is, right? Or you're trying to overcome an obstacle. All I can say is take the leap of faith. Here's a small story. Today, I, yeah, I woke up very early, did a home workout because I knew I was going to go driving, right? See, I have my license, but I have an eye condition, so I was restricting myself from driving. And this is the first time today I drove in the dark, which is very, very scary. To be completely honest, I was very uncomfortable, but I drove. And yes, I did my front parking, or, you know, I got out of it. And then when I came home, I did reverse parking. After so many attempts, I reversed the car. But it was pretty discouraging in a way, right? But at least I took the leap of faith. Something that a lot of people can't do these days. And yes, I get it, it's very scary. But the best thing you could do is take the leap of faith and not have any regrets. Sure, something bad might happen, right? But what's life without any challenges and bad moments? You can't make sure your life is full of good moments, right? Or good positive vibes every single time. Meaning, oh, every moment's gonna be a very, very good moment. No, it's gonna take time to realize, for you at least, that life is full of like different emotions. You have to experience it to the fullest. It's gonna be bad times and good times. So what I'm trying to say is that taking a leap of faith is a beautiful thing. Like for me, I'm trying to take the leap of learning how to drive properly, meaning, yeah, I got my license, but I need to get onto the road without being scared, okay? by myself and driving really good and i know the only way to do that is if i practice if i just practice 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 and that's pretty much how you get good at things right a lot of people develop their passion by practicing a certain skill for example if you're a programmer or if you're a coder whatever programmer right at first you're probably gonna hate it a lot of people hate it but the more they practice, the more better they get, and they develop a passion for it. Specifically, like, it just takes time to get better at something. And that's what I'm trying to do with driving. I want to be able to learn how to drive properly and take care of myself on my own terms. Meaning, I don't want to bust that many times these days. Or I don't want to, like, walk. I don't mind. I'm super grateful that I have the option to, but being able to drive is cool, in my opinion. It's a very sexy trait, I believe, right? For me, at least. And I always wanted to drive, but as my eye condition does bother me. But after reading up a lot of Reddit posts, people just said, hey, if you have this eye condition, you just gotta practice. And that just goes along for anything. And that just goes for anything, honestly. Just wanted to make a quick video just talking about taking the leap of faith and trusting yourself. Trust the process. It's going to be scary. But that's life, like I was saying. you just going to smile, have fun, and just keep trying. See, the reason I started to drive again is because after speaking to one of my friends, He's like, dude, you gotta just go drive me. You'll get better over time. Sure, you have this eye condition. But, like, he was explaining his story when he first started. And how he sucked at it. And he's like, dude, it just gets better over time. You just gotta take the leap of faith. You gotta just keep trying. You can't keep practicing. And that's what I'm gonna be doing. I'm gonna try my best. I'm gonna keep, keep trying. Yeah. If anyone's having troubles... Taking a leap of faith, trust yourself and just do it. Just remember to take it easy and everything will be fine.